Hello, welcome to So She Designs. My name is Shalisa, and in today's video, I'm going to share with you my Butterick haul from the last Butterick and Bow sale. If this is something you're interested in, please stay tuned. All right, everybody, let's get into the video so I can share with you the um, patterns that I picked up. I did not pick up any Vogue on this trip. I picked up one new look and the rest are going to be Butterick. So the first one that I have is Butterick 6026. This is a um, Catherine Tilton pattern. And I don't know if you can see, but I really love... I don't know if you can see the can you see the lines in the pattern i really love that that looks so nice to me and it says that it's easy really cute the next one i got to sew because this it has lace on it this is butterick 6418 i love all the views Really cute pattern. I could see making some of those for fall as well. I purchased Butterick 6496. This says it is easy. This is a little jacket. I like the jacket and I got it because I it will be easy to color block. You know, I'm always looking for opportunity to color block. Really nice. I didn't I I didn't have this pattern. I don't think I'm I may have it. I, I could not remember, so I picked it up again. But this is Butterick 6718 because I wanted a wardrobe pattern. So when I'm starting on that fall collection that I want to start on, I can pretty much use one pattern for most of the looks that I'm trying to achieve. So I purchased this. It has um the jacket, the dress, a shirt, skirt, and pants. So I think I can even if I had the pattern hack some, I could get everything, most of everything out of here. I also picked up this Butterick 6925. And I like um, princess, princess seams um, in my shirt. So I, I like the way it fits. It just looks more flattering on me. So this one has princess seams on it. And I actually like all the views, all of the necklines. Um, and I'll probably make all of them at, at some point. 6925. This is the average to sew pattern. That's the line drawings. I also picked up this because I actually have the material that I plan to make with this. I don't want to make it fall. But it's 6829. I want to make this view right here. It's supposed to be an easy, easy to sew, easy sew pattern. Here are the line drawings. And here is the material that when I purchased that pattern, I was thinking of that I had in mind. I think that's I think that's really nice. So I picked up this pattern as well. This is another wardrobe pattern, and I feel like I felt like I could also incorporate some of the um, material. I mean, fabric that I got for my collection, my fall collection. And to this one that would, you know, it would minimize how many patterns I would have to use. Um, I think Donna's things, Miss Donna, who I featured um, like last week in my Friday, and not well, the week before last. I think I think her channel is Donna, but she made like I think just about all the views, and it, her collection turned out really nice. But I purchased this and with doing a collection in mind. 
And it's a easy, it's rated easy. I purchased this. I saw this on Crumpets, Crumpets Tea and Sewing's channel. And I was like, oh, I got to get that pattern. I think this is really cute. And I'm also going to use <laughs> this fabric because I have so plenty of it to make um, a version of, of this dress. Probably the... Um, the shorter of the shorter of the three. But I have plenty of this and I wanted a dress out of this. And I made a dress um that I was thinking about refashioning into this pattern. So because it had a few hiccups on it that I don't like and I feel like I don't know if I'm gonna be able to fix it. So that's why I said I'll have a shirt made out of this and I'll have a dress. But I think this pattern will be lovely um, for this material as well. So I'm going to have a shirt and a dress made out of the same material. But it's really cute. This is Butterick 6940. And here are the line drawings. And the last pattern that I have for today is a new look. And this is for a... Um, like a sweatshirt because I want to make a sweatshirt and this is my new little pattern it's easy for knits and I was thinking about using this uh, material right here for a fall sweatshirt I was also if I don't do this pattern I'm contemplating on doing the mood pattern on um, sweatshirt because it just looks really cute to me so out of this so this will become some type of sweatshirt so that's what this material is for this or the mood pattern um, that they have on their website, which is a free pattern. So if I make it, I'll show you what I make. So you can download the pattern. You can try it as well. Those are all the patterns I got for my Butterick haul from Joann's, the last one I nine sale. I appreciate you guys for tuning in. Thank you so much. And don't forget to go and sew something fantastic and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.